What's up, Raf gang? It's Raf in the Raf cave. Welcome back to another video. Now, guys, this is going to be another butt kicker video, and I'm proud to introduce their brand new all digital amplifier, the BKA 1000-P. Now, this thing is a beast, and this is going to power up their larger LFE transducers, the big daddy ones. Now, you can power up to four of them, or you can power up to eight of the mini LFEs. So, guys, I'm excited to show this to you, and I appreciate butt kicker. For sending this to me to show you guys this is going to be amazing now you know guys i have three lfe butt kickers in the theater now so let's check it out guys the unboxing of this brand new butt kicker amp that i know you guys should definitely check out if you're going to go into the butt kicker and get the serious ones for your home theater this is the amplifier that you definitely want to get without further ado guys let's check it out be sure to hit that like button subscribe and welcome to my channel I'll show you some unboxing and butt kicker brings it again let's go so here it is guys, the brand new BKA-1000-P, the newest butt kicker amplifier from Butt Kicker that's designed to maximize your transducers from the big daddy to the small guys. This is the one to do it for you with the all new digital layout. You're able to see the frequency and the volume intensity of your butt kickers, this is fantastic. Rack mountable and a wireless remote control that comes with it, very cool. So let's check it out guys. Let's go to the website real quick and then show the unboxing. Let's go. All right, guys, so here's the website, and I'll leave the link in the description below so you can pick yours up. This is available now and ready to ship. It'll ship same day if you order it before two o'clock. And uh, yeah, you want this in your house. Let's go. All right, guys, let's check it out. It looks great. All new digital amplifier rack mountable. It's a lot wider, so it you know, matches up with the other components, which is really cool. And you can see here, uh, which butt kickers it, it, uh, it, it handles and the maximum quantity of those butt kickers here. And then you have your specs here. We're looking at 1300 watts RMS in the two ohms and 920 watts RMS in the four ohms. So still beastly power to drive transducers. Crazy power. Frequency response down to 10 hertz. Awesome. Low cut cutoff filter down to 25 hertz. Amazing. So it'll give you the wireless remote the rack mounting ears and the power cord. So uh, let's let's get it. All right, guys, here we go. Let's unbox this bad boy. And first thing we get greeted to is the owner's manual. So this will give you instructions on how to operate it and how to install it into your system. All right. Holy cow, this is huge. What a beast. Awesome, awesome amplifier. All right, so we have the wireless remote control. Now this looks very similar to the uh, the uh, wireless couch kit, uh, but this one's gonna have the high cut frequency range, so you can uh, adjust how how high you want the cutoff to start. And then you got your EQ control. Looks like we have a low cut and a high cut, uh, so you can adjust the low cut and high cut with this. And of course your volume up and down, intensity up and down, and then your power on and off. Very nice. This right here is going to be your two included uh, rack mounting kits here. So if you have a nice um, uh, rack mount, you can um, install that very nicely and secure into that. And over here is going to have your power cord, standard power cord. And now, oh yeah, we got some weight. <laughs> You know, picture, pictures do not do this justice, guys. Uh, yeah, this is a beast. This is an absolute beast of an amp. Wow, that is, that is nice. All right, I'm gonna take this out of the plastic and we'll get a little closer look. I'll be right back. All right, guys, so here's the front of the amplifier. It is a monster. It just looks impressive when it's in front of you. It's amazing. Um, so you get the front, you're gonna have your your power on and off. It'll give you a red indicator there when it's powered on. You have your clip light, just uh, just in case you're over overrunning this thing, you want to turn it down a little bit, but it's nice that it lets you know. Uh, you got your signal input, so I'm sure it'll be green and flashing when it's getting a signal from your, your receiver amplifier. Uh, remote control in sensor there, so if you want to use the remote, just point it at it and control it from afar. Um, you're going to have your low cut uh, button there, on and off, so the low cut is going to it's gonna cut the low frequencies off if you wanna do that. I, mean, I don't know if you want to, I wanna keep that low cut frequency, but sometimes you don't want it to go that low. 
Um, you're going to have your high cutoff frequency, so it's nice to let you know uh, where you want that uh, frequency range to, to start at, to where it stops the uh, the high pass. And then you're going to have your volume indicator there, so that'll tell you how much juice you're giving to the uh, transducers. Let's take a look at the back here. Man, that's an impressive looking machine. This is just really nice, guys. All right, so you're going to have your, your line level input. This is going to be your RCA input. This will be your subwoofer uh, input or your LFE input from your uh, AVR processor. That'll go there. Uh, high level input there. Then you have your speaker uh, output, your positive and negative here. You also have some binding posts if you want uh, to plug in some banana plugs. I'd recommend doing that. Uh, you're going to have your, uh, your voltage selector here. And then, of course, your uh, power, your power terminal there. BKA1000-P, all new digital amplifier. Awesome. Well, I'm going to get it installed in the uh, RAF cave system and then turn it on and show you what it looks like when it's all lit up. I'll be right back. All right, guys. So here it is installed in the RAF cave tower here. And one thing is with the, the rack mount ears, very easy installation. You just put it right on the side there. And with the included screws, put them on the side and then you have your rack mounts easily attached to mount to your tower. All right, guys, so make sure you have good ventilation above and below uh, the, the amp, which is always good for cooling. Uh, I have the power cord, the speaker wire that's going to my three butt kicker uh, uh, transducers. And then we have the LFE signal hooked up to the back. So that's all connected. We have the remote control. All right, guys, so we have power running to the amplifier with the standby light that's on. When well, you want to turn it on, hit the power button here or use the remote control here. Turns on the amplifier. You're going to have your blue light was on for low cutoff. I'm going to turn that off because we don't want to cut off anything below 25 hertz. We want that low energy to flow into the amp. So the high current, a high cutoff, um, that's... That's basically going to tell the amplifier that you want to cut it and stop giving information above that point. So for being a transducer and you want to get that low frequency rumble, I suggest going way down. I'd recommend about 45 hertz to 40 hertz, right in that range, so you just get the nice rumble of the, the low information. And then the volume is on default at 30. And of course, you can increase the intensity or lower the intensity. We'll leave it at 30 for now. Actually, I want to see what the max is. So the max is 50. So I'm thinking probably about 25, 23, right about midpoint is probably a good, a good way to go to, to gauge it. Uh, the remote control here, of course, works just fine. As long as you have that, that infrared sensor and the remote control there. And then you can adjust the high cutoff as well. So the remote control is nice. Instruction manuals here just kind of gives you an overview of what the controls do and what the knobs do. Uh, it does have some good protection in case you're over driving it. It will turn off and just to protect your butt kickers. Um, you'll, you'll tell by the clip light when it's turning on. Um, so other than that, pretty, pretty simple for an amplifier hooking it up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hook it up and play a, play a scene, and then you'll be able to see the signal light uh, uh, blinking, and then I'll really crank it and see if we're going to get to that clipping point. All right, guys, let me hook it up, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, so I got it all hooked up, and I've tested it out, and I've dialed it in just right, and it's fantastic. It drives my butt kickers just fine, and now I want to show you guys the way the signal's glowing and lighting up as the movie's going, so you can see how much juice it's given you know it's awesome so let's go ahead and play a little bit of the dark knight one of my favorite scenes the tunnel chase <laughs> so 
So cool. So you can tell when the gunshots are going. You can see the light just gets more intense. And when the rocket launcher went off, the green light just went more intense. You just know that you're getting a lot of maximum signal going to the butt kickers. So shaking your, your couch, your chair, or your home theater seats. So it's, it's pretty amazing, guys. So it's a great looking amplifier. I love the look of it. I love the way you can tell how, what the frequency range is, what the, the intensity of the volume is. It tells you the signal's on and it lets you know if it's going to clip. So you can do, adjust it from there. But guys, this is a fantastic amplifier from Butt Kicker. It's the brand new BKA 1000P. Uh, definitely a must own if you have some Butt Kicker uh, transducers in your theater. You want to give them the maximum juice. Absolutely fantastic. I want to thank Butt, Butt Kicker for sending this to me to show the Raft Gang Nation. Guys, the link in the description below. Click on that link, takes you to the website, and they have them in stock, so they can sh ship them out to you right away. So definitely worth, guys, and get this in your, your entertainment center. And you get the rack mount as well, so it look beautiful on your rack. It's going to be fantastic, guys. All right, there it is, the Butt Kicker Amplifier BK1000P. Thanks for watching this unboxing and setup video. Like, subscribe, share, and I'll see you in the next one. Home Theater Rules, Butt Kicker. Raph out. See ya.